what previous experience, project management experience did you have? Before I joined Almond Kirib, I had no professional experience. I've done a few bits here and there. Uh, my last role was as a customer service advisor. So basically, I had no professional experience coming into um, Almond Kirib's. How, how long was the last, how long ago have you worked? Whoa, uh, over a year. Okay. It was uh, the end of 2011. Okay. That's when I last worked. So, how was the training? How was Almond Kirib's training? Uh, the training was um, was very good. It was very hands-on. On one hand, we had uh, the classes, the tutorials. On the other hand, we had the um, the hands-on experience. So it was it was uh, the best of both worlds, really. Mm. So have you gotten a job now? Yes, I have. I uh, on Wednesday I got a job as a project support officer for NHS. Ah, that's great! Congratulations. Thank you. Um, so, what advice would you have for those that um, are looking to join our one career training? Don't delay. Yeah. Um, you really you need this. If you if you're thinking of uh, switching careers, our one careers is the best for you because it will give you the training you need, the experience, and also the hands-on experience you need to secure a job within project management. Okay, now um, a lot of people have been worried about joining this training because they think they don't have Prince 2 certification. Do you have any Prince 2 certification? No, I don't. Oh, really? Yes, really. So how were you able to get a job without Prince 2 certification? My experience was enough to secure me a job without yeah. Prince 2. I've had a couple of other interviews without Prince 2. Mm. Really, um, the experience is more relevant than the qualification. But then obviously it's good to have the qualification later, isn't it? Yeah, but you can have the qualification later, but that is not the determining, um, determining criteria, factor, yeah. factor really, exactly. Mm. Thank you very much.